Hey guys, how's it going? English Twist I take a serious thanks for joining me today and for showing me your support. I greatly appreciate all your uh, rates, your comments and subscriptions. Um, I am eternally grateful. Thank you very much. My numbers are building as we speak. Um, I do need more subscriptions. Well, I say need. I would love more subscriptions. So if you do like my videos, I, I thoroughly encourage you to uh, subscribe to my channel. And then you'll catch all my latest videos. Alright, without further ado, as you can see, this video is uh, it's, uh, titled you know, How to Change Your um, Default SMS Tones on Your iPhone to uh, Your Customized SMS Ringtones. Well, it doesn't read that exact thing, but that's the gist of this video. Okay, now for this video, there are a few specific items of software that you will need. Uh, you're going to need an MP3 file uh, that uh, you wish to get a ringtone sound from. Okay. You will also need to, if you haven't already, got a sound editing software that you're capable of making uh, AIF files, which uh, if you want to use the file, the software that I'm using, it is Waypad Sound um, Editor, and you can. Ha I have a link in my description which allows you to download it straight from the internet. There's no subscriptions or anything like that. You just it's straight up. It's a setup. You, know, you press it and it will install it onto a computer, run it and install it. There's no viruses, so please don't please don't assume that I'm uh, trying to do bad acts. But yeah, you know, without further ado, just carry on. Sorry, I'm mumbling. All right, and you're also going to need uh, WinSCP. All right. Now, this right here is actually my iPhone because I I want to show you my iPhone as I'm doing this video. This is an, a dynamic display, as you can see. Let me come into the calendar. Of course, calendar. Yeah. There's my calendar application. Opens up perfectly. Okay. So I'm going to show you this as we go along. Alrighty, without further ado, what we're going to do is you will, once you've downloaded your uh, WavePad software, you'll open it up, like so, and then with your uh, sound file, you want to make sure that it's easy accessible. I would suggest that you put it on your desktop, um, because for this one reason that you're actually with this software you're able to just click and drag it and put it straight into um, your WavePad master editor. Okay, and now what you're going to do is once you've actually got it in there, you are going, sorry, once you've dragged your sound clip into the uh, um, webpad master, you are going to edit it. Okay, and it's just easy as that. Look, you see I'm selecting and editing it right here, edit that, just delete, don't need that. Okay, and once you've got your sound, now guys, you want this to be as short as possible, okay? You want a short and sweet sound. You don't want to go ahead and throw in any fandango bloody ringtone because whatever that tone is, it will continue to play um, regardless whether you've opened your text message, read it, put the phone down, it will continue to play, okay? Um, that's how these tech the SMS tones are set up. They're just short, sharp sounds, and that's it. Okay, if you've ever noticed when you've had a text message, you pressed it and it will still ding if you're like on your phone as you're doing it, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So make it short and sweet. As you can see, my one is actually about a second long. So I've actually got it on screen. Right? You can see there, it's about a s just under a second. A quarter of a se three quarters of a second. Okay. Now you're going to go to File. Once you're done editing, go to File. Save File As. Okay. Make sure it's saved to the right location. I suggest put it to the desktop. Then you're going to save it as an AIF file. All right. Then you're going to press Save. And then you'll get this box, and you'll press OK. All right. Then, as you can see up here, it's appeared. It's slightly off the camera, but that's not to worry. We're going to close out our WavePad. I'm going to take this file. Okay, this is our new file. This was our original MP3 file, as you can see right here. We've got the new AIF file. We're going to rename this little puppy. Go ahead and check out my description because there are six. Um, I'll put five in the description, but there are actually six designated names that you can label these, and they can only be these names, okay? So make sure that you spell them out exactly how I have spelt them in the um, description, and if you're doing this along with me, then great, follow the steps, and that's it. And we're going to change the AIF to a CAF, okay? That's imperative that you do that. Then obviously you're going to get the prompt to change it, now, obviously, guys, I'm working off of Windows Vista right now, so you will actually have to uh, change 
the settings, you have to go into your uh, control panel and make it so you can actually view the extensions on the files so you can change the format of them because I know on Vista you, they're not they're hidden. Okay, but if you need to know how to do that, send me a PM and I'll send you some quick directions. Alright, so we've got the uh, file all set up. Now what we've got to do is we'll go into uh, WinSCP. Um, I've got mine down here, so I can open up WinSCP. And I also put the logo up there, that's what it actually looks like. Um, we've got WinSCP opened. You'll log into it. You know how to SSH into your uh, iPhone. What we're going to do is go right back to the root. Then we'll go to System, Library, come down to Audio, then UI Sounds. Now this bit, you want to do a bit of tweaking, okay? Uh, I'll just put this over here real quick. Okay, easy, easy, easy assessment. All right. Now, as you can see right here, these are the names that I put in the in the description, so they look familiar to you. Uh, these are the only six that you can change because all these others uh, note to ringtones and other things like that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and select the one that we've named the file. I put mine to six, okay, number six. So I'm going to come to this number six here. I'm going to right-click, rename it, and take off the CAF and put VAK. All right. So that way it makes it a backup. That makes the sound a backup. Okay. That is pretty much imperative that you do that. Okay, because uh, you don't want to go and lose that sound if you then choose that this sound isn't what you want, alright? So then you're going to take your file on your desktop and you're just going to drag it into this directory, okay? And it's going to ask you to copy it, press copy, la la la, and there it is. Alright, and that's just that, that's it, easy as that. Okay, you come out of your, um, whatchamacallit, WinSCP, SSH, and come into your settings, obviously we're going to test it out now. Sounds and new text message, and I've saved it to number six zero one two three four five six. And here it is, guys. This is the ringtone that I changed. Excuse me. It's <laughs> a bit of comedy for you there, guys. All right, and just for your information, if you want to change it back and you think, well, that's a bit tasteless, so what you do is you come into your SSH right click it, delete the file that you put in, ok, and remember we saved our backup, so we'll come to our backup file, rename that, change this VAK to CAF, hit enter, it changes, we exit out of our WinSCP, go ahead and bounce back to the start, come to settings, do -do -do. I hope you like this guys, I hope this is informative for you now come to sounds, new text message, and this is what it should originally sound like. There you go guys, if you liked it, then you keep it, if you don't, that's how easy it is to change. Alright guys, well this has been another tutorial from your one and only English Twist. I hope you like it, and I wish you could see my actions, but you know what time it is. It's time to rock out. You take it easy, rate, comment, and subscribe. Keep the love coming, because I love you all watch out for my next video. Alright guys, take it easy. Bye.